morning, guys. I'm a lumpy child. Okay, I think that's a little bit better. Sorry. Thanks for stopping by my channel, Makeup and Magnolias. I'm so excited to have you guys watch my video. What I have compiled today is a haul for a beach trip that I have coming up. So I have some swimsuits, some beach bags, just some miscellaneous things that I've gotten and some deals that I've found. So I'm just going to do that haul with you guys. So I guess we will roll on into that. Okay, so two things before we jump into that, actually more. If you like this button, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you want to be notified of any future uploads. I couldn't think of the word. I've been out shopping all day and it's like 106, no lie. And wearing that mask, so this is why I look this way. And I'm just having all these brain farts. But anyways, so there's that. Subscribe and like if you like it. And also, I'm filming in my daughter's room, which I'm sure you could tell because we slept in my bedroom last night. And just to be honest, I didn't make my bed this morning. I didn't feel like it. We got up early and we got dressed and we went shopping. And so it is what it is. So here we are in my daughter's room. It was um, a little bit tidier than mine. I know that's crazy, but it is. So now the haul. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to show you guys are some things that I picked up for my daughter. And I got these on the Disney Store online. They had a really good sale on their sunglasses and their beach towels. And then they also had free shipping. So I got her these cute pair of star glasses. And they have mini on the side. And this side says Daydreamer. And I think they were marked down to $5. She loves them. She thinks she's a superstar when she has them on. So... They're super cute and I also got her these cute ones that have flowers and they have Alice from Alice in Wonderland right here you can see like a little sticker right here and they were also marked down to five dollars the beach towels were marked down to ten and I got her this one right here and it has let's see there's a picture it has Mickey Minnie Goofy, Pluto, Daisy, and Donald. And there's what the beach towel looks like. And it says Beach Buddies. And it's just super cute. And she loves it. And it's fun. Here's the characters that are on it. And it was marked down to $10. And, of course, you cannot go to the beach without an aerial beach towel. That's what it looks like all unfolded up. So, it has aerial and flounder. And the colors are really vibrant and pretty on these towels. And they were um, $10, they were marked down to $10, and then Disney had free shipping too. So I'm kind of just like grabbing as I go. I have it all piled up behind me, so it may not really have a rhyme or reason to it, but that's okay. Okay, I have a beach bag, because you have to have that going to the beach, and it came with a little mini bag. I guess you could store your sunscreens in here. You might could put like a wet swimsuit in there if you need it to, and it's rather large, and I like it because it's mesh, and so the sand will fall out of it. And I found this at Ross, and it was originally $12, and it was marked down to $7.99, so just a beach bag to take snacks down or towels or or whatever you need to take down with you. Um, I think I have another, I have another beach towel, beach towel, beach bag right here that I got from Amazon, and it is a Sand Away beach bag, and it's really big. It's also mesh, um, and I like the mesh so that the sand will fall out of it, and it comes in this cute little carrier bag, so you can it away easy without having to fold it and take up a lot. Okay, so that's neat. It just like pops out of here and then unfolds into a really big beach bag. At least the picture looks really bad. It is 18 by 18. So 18 inches by 18. So those, I got those. I also on Amazon got my daughter some water shoes and these were on sale, I believe. They were only like $12 or $13, if I'm not mistaken. And I'll try to link them below if I remember them with the price. And these are really cute. They're light pink, and they have sailboats, and an octopus, and a whale, and light, and a lighthouse on them. And they're light pink. And these are in a size 26, 27, which I believe in U.S. was a 910. So... And she says they're really comfortable and she likes them and she can be kind of 
she's five, so she's a little bit ticky about her shoes and clothing now, but, but she okays those, so those were a good find. Um, another thing off of Amazon I got on sale, it was more, I think I got this for like $23, 24 and it's a swimsuit cover-up, and it's really cute. It has the palm loose on it, and it has the little palms on the side, and it is really sheer. You could wear this as like a tunic or a shirt if you put like a tank under it, but it is really sheer. I don't know if you can tell, see my hand through it, but when I tried it on, you can see through it really well, which is fine because I'm just going to use it as a swimsuit cover-up. And I would say, I'll try to find this again and link it below, and I would say size up. I normally do like a medium, but this is a large, extra large, and I feel like it fits it fits just fine. So I think they run about a size smaller. Um, so I would size up in it if you're like me and you want it kind of midway down your leg, you want it to cover your rear and things like that, I would size up, but it's really cute. And it gives me like that, I don't know, anytime I see these palms, I don't know why, I just think of like Golden Girls. It gives me just like some Golden Girl vibes and just like a really good cover up. And I found, I guess we can go to swimsuits now. I found this today while shopping at Marshall's and it had it on, they had it on clearance for $10 and it's one of the um, rash guard swimsuits and it is UPF 50 plus. And this is for my daughter obviously and it's really cute. It says hello summer and it has these little flowers. They kind of, no, I thought they were felt filling but they're not, they're just like a swimsuity material feel and look at the bottom they're so cute they have the gold glitter and so this was marked down to ten dollars at Marshall so I thought that was a really good deal she has some one pieces and some little um tankinis or as she says the ones that show my belly but I figured we might need one of these also in case we get a little pink or anything like that so I, I grabbed that for ten bucks and then my swimsuits, I found this first one at Dillard's, and the brand is Gibson Latimer. And here's the top. And what I like the most about this is that it has the thick band right here, so it's going to cover. And I also like the thick side on it because it just keeps everything covered and tucked in. And I got the matching bottoms that are, of course, the high waisted bottoms. And it ties in the front and I was lucky enough to snag this on sale at Dillard's I believe the bottoms were 28 and the top was 27 if I can find it on their website I'll link it below but I don't know since it was on clearance if I'll be able to find it or not but I thought it was really cute I have worn this one I wore it to the pool the other day and I really like it and then I got this really pretty green and it is a Ralph Lauren. And I also found this at Dillard's. They had all their swimsuits marked down. The top was on sale. It was still a little pricey, but it is Ralph Lauren. The top was on sale for $49, but it was regularly $74. So it was a big savings. Here's the top. And then I really like the gold on it, and it just has the clasp. And I got these high-waisted bottoms. And the bottoms were 38, but they were originally 58. And then they always put that on the back. I got a really pretty one-piece blue Ralph Lauren last year too that I really, really liked. And then the last one I picked up, this is really cute. I got this from a store locally, actually. It's this really cool place that has like a bunch of different boots and they sell clothing and they sell, um, shoes home decor food just kind of like anything you can think of and here's the top it's kind of like a bra top and it has oranges on it and then here's the bottom i thought it was so cute i love the citrus on it and then it has a little ruffle so here are the bottoms and it has a little ruffle and this one was a really a good price it was only 28 i believe or 27 for the whole thing so that whole bikini was 27 28 and I like 
the high-waisted ones because being a mom now and being 33 I just like everything a little covered and a little tucked in so that's what I always go with there's those and then let's see okay I got this really neat beach mat originally I had bought this for my daughter but then I found a cuter one for her at a different store which I'll be showing you I just feel like my camera keeps going wonky dog I have to look into this because it's like leaning anyway I found this at Ross for $14.99 and I thought it was really cute it has a, a carrying handle and it has a pillow on it that comes with it so you can I guess take a little nappy nap on the beach I'm all for that and it's just a really cute fun pattern and the one I got for my daughter you guys are gonna love it super cute I believe this one was 14 or 15 as well I found it at Home goods and it has seashells on it and it rolls up and it has a built-in pillow on it as well and I just thought I bought that other one for her but then I saw this one and I was like oh she's got to have this one so I'll use the other one okay let's see I'm gonna scooch my stuff close to me next big thing I have I found at where did I find this guy at Home goods. I had been looking online on Amazon and I really didn't want to pay 50 to 100 bucks for one of these um, pop up like UV tents. So I found, I was lucky enough to find one at Home Goods for $29.99. And this is the pattern of it. And you can see right here on the tag, let me pull it down. It pops up and it's just a sun shelter. I thought that would be really good um especially with having a little one that's going along on the trip i gotta move sorry y'all my foot is falling asleep underneath my rear and it doesn't feel good anyway moving on then at target i found this cute little bag for on clearance for five dollars it's a flamingo and it has some little beach toys in it like little molds there's a sunshine and a starfish a pineapple, a regular fish, and a seashell, and there is also a popsicle. So I thought those would be really cute and fun for her um, to play in the sand with and give her something to do. And let's see, we got, I got, Mama got her something fun too. I got this word search book from Five and Below. It was $4.00. Um, and it's a word search book. It has 250. And this is the inside of it. It just has the words and you find them. So that's what I'm going to be doing between reading and word searching. That's what you can find me doing on the beach. And I picked up some pins at five and below for 225. Just some little colored big pins to do my word search with. Because that's a must. Oh, something else cool we found at five and below. This is a Bluetooth go square wireless speaker i'm not sure how great this is going to work but it was 5.95 so i'm guessing five and below has some things that are a little more than five dollars like sometimes dollar tree will get things that are a little more than a dollar but it was only 5.95 they had one that you plugged in that was five dollars but the bluetooth one was 5.95 but it's really cute it has flamingos on it and it says it is compatible with all bluetooth devices and has two hours of play time with a built-in rechargeable battery for indoor and outdoor use. So we're gonna take that to the beach with us and play some tunes and see if it works. But if it doesn't, like I said, it was only $5.95, so I'm not really out Vukuza money, so that'll be okay. Also at five and below, we got a beach ball for a dollar. Of course, just have to, there's also a pool at the condo we're gonna stay at, so we can have that for the beach or the pool. Just something fun. We have a shovel, because you just need a shovel at the beach to shovel some sand. And we're also gonna be going crab hunting at night. So this may come in handy, especially for my daughter. I'm not really sure. She's excited about crab hunting, but I'm not sure how she's gonna react um, when she actually gets upon those crustaceans because she is not about like any kind of bugs. And I was telling her actually how when you go to the beach, sometimes you can get a pet hermit crab. 
and I was telling her how when I was younger I had gotten a hermit crab when we went to the beach and I thought she would think it was the coolest thing and want one and I was kind of excited you know I was like oh we can get a hermit crab and she was like mom who wants a crab for a pet like she was just appalled by the whole situation so I guess we're not gonna get in a pet hermit crab but anyways I digress we got a shovel and we got bucket of course at five and below and I don't this is one dollar it has the little shovel kind of one of the little flimsier shovels with it I didn't think she wanted to get really that close to the crabs so we got that what I didn't find was a net we might have found a net somewhere to go crab hunting with but we also got this really cool bucket it was four dollars and it's a collapsible bucket so you can just push it in and it collapses down and I thought that was really neat especially for space you can store this really nicely it doesn't take up as much room as say your regular bucket that you're trying to um, pack or take and then it just it's kind of difficult though you just pop it back out so I thought that was really cute and a really neat idea from the five and below store I can get it to work right apparently I think this works right I think it's a user error but and I think the last thing I have is some good old sunscreen we found this at Sam's and it is the Neutrogena Beach Defense 50 with water and sun protection it has two of the spray bottles and one of this the regular old lotion so they didn't have any kids kind of sunscreen at Sam's so I guess I'm gonna have to pick that up at Walmart for my daughter because I still like to use the kids kind with her oh that's the beach ball I was sitting on I was like what did I forget if you you will realize that I kind of go like here there and everywhere sometimes because that's just how my mind works I apologize but anyways that is it for the things I have for the beach so far. The only other thing I got that I didn't want to haul up the stairs and into the room is we got one of those really big, nice utility wagons with like the big wheels and it has two cup holders so we can wheel all our stuff. And we found that at Sam's and I think it was $59.99. And so I'm excited about that so I don't have to haul the stuff on my shoulder down to the beach. Our condo is on the beach, but you have to kind of walk down and then go down just like a little short pier. So we can just roll that down there and not have to tote as many heavy things. So I think that's everything. No, me, I probably forgot something, but that's okay. Okay, so I accidentally forgot to show you guys the coolest thing. So I'm filming it now, but I'm gonna try to edit it and put it. Sorry, my it's just all wonky dog. We're just gonna be looking at each other like this for a minute. Anyway, I'm gonna edit this and put it before I did the ending, but just know that I did forget something like the best thing to show you guys. I was getting up and walking out of my room and I was like, Anyways, I found this um, folding beach chair with umbrella, and it was $14.99 at Marshall's, and I thought it was really cute. It's just this beach chair that has mermaids on it, and it came with the umbrella that you attach to it. So, that is officially the last thing of this haul. Thanks for putting up with my scatterbrain today. So I'm going to work on getting this video uploaded and it shouldn't take me long because I'm not really gonna edit it. I'm just gonna do this one as more of, I guess, a quote unquote vlog style and just whatever I said or if I looked silly or did something silly, I'm just gonna roll with it, put it in there. The other things I have in the works, just so you can know and look forward to hopefully is I have a bathroom redo video coming up I'm almost finished with it so that'll be coming out really soon I will have a clothing and haul and a house decor haul and then I will be doing a a.m. and p.m. skincare routine and a video of favorite skincare products and I'll also be doing makeup on my channel so I like a lot of things, so you will see anything from cooking, to decor, to shopping hauls, to um, makeup, to skincare, just kind of anything I'm into or anything I want to share with you guys, I will probably upload, so I hope that's okay. And I hope you guys enjoy my channel, and I hope you enjoyed this first video 
video well actually it's my third I started a year ago but then you know a life just gets in the way sometimes but I'm gonna do better this time and stay on track so if you like this video be sure and give it a thumbs up and subscribe and hit the little bell so that you can be notified of any future uploads on my channel so I guess I'm going to sign off Hi.